guys, uh, welcome back to another uh, episode of Minecraft here, it's Herf here, uh, and as if you can see, as you can see, I have, I have been herfed. Uh, apparently I did not disconnect from the server when I stopped recording at the end of the last episode, and apparently I was in the ocean, or I was in the boat, and something sunk the boat, not really sure what happened, but apparently I uh, drowned. And uh, I have no idea how to get back <laughs> to this area. Uh, I don't think I'm going to bother to try to fumble through and find it again. We'll just head in a different direction. <laughs> so uh, I had some plans for that place. There was a nice flat surface over there. We were going to make some uh, good trees around on other islands. We had a flat spot there for farms. Um, the beautiful uh, biome, uh, the, the the warm ocean with the coral and everything would have been great. But yeah, I screwed it up. So, <laughs> uh, what is this? I've already had a disaster. This is what episode four or five or something. I lost track. I don't think. So, and we get to respawn at night. So I've, I, uh, great, 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 great. So I guess I'm just gonna punch a tree and see how this goes. So welcome to the start of Minecraft, everyone. Ah, uh, God. So, yep, Minecraft take two. Uh, get some trees. Make some wooden stuff. Try to survive the night. And uh, we'll, we'll pick up where we left off. So, <laughs> I apologize for my uh, just complete and oh, you know what actually this may not be a bad idea to just go up a couple unless a skeleton's nearby or a spider that can climb up but yeah so eh, this is exactly what i was talking about in the in the beginning where i said i'm going to do dumb stuff and i'm going to panic and i'm not going to pay attention because what did i say at the end of the last episode there where to remind myself that i need to number one when i get off my boat I need to set the bed down, right, and set a spawn point. And what did I do? I did not even get off the boat. I, uh, I just, I just, I just sat there, and uh, something happened. In the meantime, I don't know. Uh, and anyway, all is lost. Tragedy number one. That was actually my first death in this uh, in this series. So, um, rip original herf. I know in herf version two, a better, stronger, smarter herf. Oh, I just heard a. Uh, huh. Yeah, I did. I heard a zombie. <laughs> Leave herf alone. He is weak and vulnerable and stupid. Apparently, what can go wrong right here? Oh my gosh. Well, I can't actually go this way. Well, that's good. He can't get this way either. Did he forget about me? He did. All right. Can we see the... It's exactly midnight. Fantastic. I have a knack for joining the server at the worst possible time. Or maybe it's just nighttime all the time. There's a creeper down there. I don't want to deal with you. In order to deal with you, I would have to die anyway. So. Uh, is that actually on fire over there? It is. Look at that. There must be some lava. Uh, oh, you know what I could do is make my way down to that, that little chasm. I know I saw that in the beginning. Uh, didn't seem to be a ton down there, but you know what? We'll give it a try. What is on to here? Anything? Wait, where am I? Oh, I see we get some lag. Okay. We call. Shoot, he's gonna find me again. Isn't he? There we go. I will. I will take a little bit of damage to get away from him. Oh. Uh, Oh my goodness, there's quite a bit of lava down here. Yeah. 
Well, we're right near the original spawn, so I think what I'm going to do is just jump in this water. Should be fine. We have some light. Nothing's going to spawn as long as nothing comes from up that way. Let's hide over here. Don't need any baddies raining down on top of me. So, let's create a few things and we'll get started all over again. So, anyway, apologize for that. We're going to go out and we get to explore again. We get to look for new stuff again. So, let's go with uh, four of these. And we'll get some sticks. Split the sticks up. Um... Sorry, I'm just, uh, again, the walking and chewing gum thing. I am trying my best not to cry a little bit right now. Got some tears in my eyes. I really love that biome. And, of course, you know, I probably would have hated living there, but the fact that I can't live there now because of my own error is making me sad. And But this is, the, uh, this is what you get with Herf. And this place seems really terrible. There's like nothing in here. I don't see any coal. I don't see any. It's so dark. I'm going to get out of here. I don't see any iron. I don't see any coal. All I see is nothing. It's like the never ended story, right? Is it, is it the, the one with the nothing? Uh, let's see, maybe I can climb. <laughs> uh, you guys should take bets on whether or not I fall down here in the lava. I'm going to try to go up this water. Okay, made it this far. Well, you know what? Uh, I got some time. Let's I need to collect some... Uh, Need to collect some cobble anyway, so let's start getting some cobble. We'll just make our way back up. Uh, try not to fall in lava. Let's try not to do something epically stupid again. So I wish I could say that was on purpose and staged, but that's just me. Game mismanagement 101. Uh, yeah, I wish I could say it's because I'm new, but you know what? I'm not new to Minecraft. I've been playing Minecraft for a, a, a long time. Doggone it. I'm smarter than that. So, what should we do? I think we're going to... Oh, 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 okay. It's a good thing I have a sword. I'm going to take 35 hits. Kill you, but uh, I'm going to get some zombie meat. Oh, and your friend. Uh, that a skeleton over there? There's no way I'm gonna kill him. He will kill me. I really would like some arrows and stuff, but um, I'm gonna stay away. So I think I'm gonna make uh, a boat. Pretty sure we proved there was nothing much here. Ah, you know what I could do? So I started to say. You know what I could do? And then... I was rudely interrupted by Gooey101, uh, my youngest daughter. She was... coming up here just to hassle me. So, what I was starting to say is that, you know what I could do, is that I could come over here. Because I missed a pumpkin at some point in that first episode, and that is uh, sticking. Sticking in my brain. Uh, and actually, when I was reviewing some footage, I missed a second pumpkin uh, further down. So I am going to uh, um, take a, a, a quick foray over here since it's dark. And we'll see if we can find that pumpkin that I flew right by the first time. I don't quite remember where it is, which is the same issue I had last time because I couldn't find it. There it is right there. I think I see it. Can be with my bad eyes finding things. Woohoo! 
Oh, there's two of them. Sorry, I shouldn't be excited about a pumpkin like that. All right, all right. Things are looking up in this uh, in this play in, in this this first original playthrough. Um, you know what else else is? I I think there were some. Uh, there was more sheep up over here, right? So I'm gonna see if I can retrace my steps and and, and go go uh, acquire some wool for a bed. Uh, I would love to kill that spider and get some string, but um, you know what? Do I dare jump out of here? I don't know if I do. Kill, 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 kill the fishermen. Oh, okay. Ooh, they started to come out. Come on, man. Alright, let's go. Kill! So, hopefully the game mechanics will... Uh, oh, I gotta, I gotta need air. We'll make, uh, sorry to say, the game mechanics, uh, make everything float in the water now. So if you die in the water, all your stuff will eventually float back up. That was not always the case. I had uh, at least one epic tragedy that I can recall where I was floating through the water. I actually had a fair amount of, of good stuff. Uh, you know, diamond swords, diamond, you know, enchanted diamond stuff. Um... And it was right around when they introduced the drought. So I was uh, I was uh, tridented by a drought out in the middle of the ocean. And uh, at least I think it was then. But whatever it was, I, no, you know what it was? It wasn't that at all. I threw accidentally as I was in a boat driving around. I accidentally threw my sword. I hit Q or whatever the button is on the keyboard to, to toss you know, your selected item. And there it went. Uh, right down to the bottom of the ocean. And it was a diamond sword. I don't believe it was was uh, too well enchanted or anything. Uh, it was early on. But I was not equipped uh, to, to be able to get to the bottom of the deep ocean and back. Totally would have drowned. So I just stood there in horror. As my uh, my only weapon was now lost at sea, tragically. So um, they have changed that so that now, if uh, you know, if you kill something in the water, you drop stuff. Um, it floats right back up after I don't know a couple seconds. So it's uh, it's a little bit better, but they've also made it much more treacherous with the. The spear throwing, trident throwing, uh, drowned critters. So, truly a mess. So, not really sure. I just wanted to come over here quick and grab uh, some, some sheep. Uh, I killed all the cows that were here, uh, but I don't have uh, any of that stuff left because, as we all know, it was gone. Um, yeah, I looked here. I don't want to go this way. And I'm going to go back to the ocean. Well, actually, just head in a different direction. And, uh, I don't want to spend all day trying to find where I used to be. I don't think we went super far, but I kind of went all over the place in the, in this, the, the snowy ice biome thing there. Where's my boat? I do need to cook. That fish is not super urgent at the moment, but it's going to get there, so. I have stuff with which to make a bed, at least. So, away we go! We have pirates. We like the letter R. Oh man, if I only had a parrot. Then I could go try to find like a pirate skin. Yeah, yeah. What is what is the button to show? Like, is it F5? Oh, it's F5. All right. So apparently, I'm wearing a 
some kind of a king outfit. Uh, woo. Okay. Did we come this way? I think we came this way before. But we're going to go in a different direction. Far away from that tragedy. Even if it means climbing mountains. I need to separate myself from the, the tragedy. And the anxiety, I, I'm going to pretend that didn't happen. My confidence is shaken. Herf is doubting himself. It looks like we haven't gone this way, because I think we're, we're building new chunks. The endless snowy biome. I should probably go over there and get some more trees and saplings, because you don't you don't see a ton of the spruce everywhere. Unless you find one, you find a million of them. Uh, I want to get these saplings because you can uh, ultimately make the the, the the giant spruce trees with the four saplings, and pretty much an endless. Uh, endless amount uh, of wood. So we'll try to take down a couple of these. The wood will help us out in the short term. We get some uh, saplings and then we can make some giant things when we settle down. And we have a renewable source of giant trees. Looks like we had a little lag there. Come on, man. Give me some saplings. Herf is impatient. There's one. Yeah! Oh, two. Dose saplings. Uh, let's get it all. While we wait for some of those to break and drop. Does Herf have dirt? I believe Herf has a dirt. does. Yep, so back in the day we used to play a ton of Minecraft and we would, we would you know, you would scaffold, right? That was your, your way to get up there uh, to, to hire things. You would just scaffold with dirt or gravel or something, you know, junk you had in your inventory. Alright, we got four. We are out of here. And uh, now they actually have the bamboo, uh, which you can make scaffolding with. So I have not tried that yet, but uh, that'll be a fun thing to, to, to try at some point. So yeah, there's a bunch of new features that, uh, that I haven't really tried out. Um, so I'm looking forward to messing around. Uh, once we get a little further here, we get established, and we can uh, we can stop with the grindy stuff, and we can uh, we can set out on goals. But for now, I have to overcome my herfness. Uh, I'm also trying to keep an eye. I see some flowers over there. I hate those flowers. <laughs> I like to keep an eye out for the roses, uh, as well as like all the tulips and some different uh, kind of flower flower patches. Okay, well, looks like uh, we're just gonna we're just gonna run run run. Oh, you know what? I keep forgetting. I don't have any food. Was that a baby sheep? <laughs> Chicken. Come here, chicken. Oh, 
All right, I was going to say we got some lag, but nope, we just have some poor execution. Uh, gotta get, uh, gotta get my poultry. Do we have some? Uh, what is it? Mutton? What are they? Uh, is that what the sheep's is? Cooked mutton? Sheep's? Did I just say that? I swear I'm better at English than that. I'm actually a reasonably smart, dude. But I don't feel like it's coming out that way. <laughs> hey, is that a rose right there? It's a rose bush. Yeah, boy. All right. Let's, let's, is it just? Oh no, there's a few over here. Okay. When I grab these, I like to grab them in stacks of eight. I don't really know why. I don't know if you can actually grow these or not. I mean, I know if I put some uh, bone meal down here, it will probably grow roses since they grow here naturally. But uh, yeah, I'll grab ten because there's ten here. But I don't know if you can uh, if you put them next to each other, do they make more roses? I don't really know that mushrooms work like that sometimes, but. Oh, it's a bee. Don't sting me. Don't sting me. Run in, run in. Oh, I'm going to make it. Dogs. I uh, I don't have any bones to tame you, so off we go. But I do I like a dogs. <laughs> it's an old an old Saturday Night Live skit. Uh, uh, what was that woman's name? The comedian. Uh, I can't remember her name at the moment. It'll come to me eventually, but... Man, I just... It's broke my sword. They don't make wooden swords like they used to. Uh, here's another chicken. Yeah, anyway, so... Uh, oh, what was her name? I'll forget. It, it, she, was, she was very funny. She kind of had, a, I think, a tragic family story. Um, but... Uh, she was on Saturday Night Live for a few years. Yeah, she did this skit where she was uh, some kind of a crazy uh, like dog owner or something, and she always had this little tiny dog, like uh, you know, like a purse-sized dog. And he, all the dog, always looked like it was scared out of its mind, you know, being uh, being on stage in front of all those people. But she had that catchphrase, which she would say, "But I do, I like her dogs." And so, we, oh, we're back to the ocean here, okay? And shockingly, it's almost nighttime. Well, I'm just gonna peter around here, and uh, uh, I'll bring you guys back. Um, maybe we'll just call this an episode, and then uh, I'll do some hunting. Or just some ocean crossing. And I'll bring you back uh, if, if, if I find land or something interesting in the start of the next episode. Alright guys, well thanks. Uh, be afraid to hit the like button if you, if you enjoy what you're watching. And uh, uh, subscribe if you care to. It will help us out. and appreciate it. And thanks a lot. We'll see you in the next one. And I'm going to disconnect from the server this time.